Hey guys, just looking to edit my second project inside Reaper for video. Uh, the first one I did with a screen cap and that was fine, straight out of QuickTime, dropped it in and it was all good. But I came across this little snag here, which was the ratio of the video. And to me it's kind of like 4x3 old school and a little bit squished. So I went in and right click and we can go into the video properties. And it was videoed at 1440 by 1080 25 frames per second. Okay, interesting. And right click again and preserve video aspect ratio. So, well, that might help me out. Let me get rid of that one. Bingo. Okay, we're all good. So I worked through my editing process and uh, at the end went to render it and it was like, oh, oh dear. And it had come out four by three again. So, what I ended up doing was coming into Reaper and just looking at the file project settings. So these were the defaults that are in there. So I thought we'll actually change this to 25 frames per second, which is what I'm working in anyway. Preferred video, so we got 1920 by 1080. And preserved aspect ratio letterbox when resizing. No, I turned that off. And turned on always resize output to the preferred video size, which we've got up here and always resize video sources to the preferred video size. So let's go for that. Save as project default settings. So we got through all of that and uh, I think we're actually onto a good thing. Now one of the other things I wanted to do was actually when I go to render, let's just pull that up and get this out of the way because it was hiding. So I set up a preset inside of uh, Reaper here for YouTube videos. So I went in there and there it is. So I'll just walk you through it. So I've got this set up as a stereo uh, channels. I was trying to do this output as mono, but I was keep getting a little nag screen. Can't quite remember exactly what it says, but I put it into stereo. It was something to do with the audio and it just wouldn't complete the file. Well, it looked like it was, but it wasn't going anywhere. So I've got this set on Mac for MPEG-4 mob files and we got that one there down here i've set this video codec for 4000 kilobits per second and the audio aac at 320 anything less than 4000 and any kind of graphics that you might put on the screen just don't tend to come out as good so it's kind of you can probably do it with more but either way it seems to work out pretty fine as you can see from the previous videos and uh, got that set for 25 frames per second so we shouldn't get any aliasing issues or funny jittery stuff on the screen which I've had before and then just click render but if you go through those processes and just set up your project the way that you want it uh, each time or save it as a default and work it from there you should have no issues with that video when it comes back to it so that you actually look at it and it's not four by three hasn't happened on all my sources but that was straight off a camera that was a Canon Legria and uh, it was the mob file that was straight off there and it was like, whoa, that's strange. Well, hopefully that helps you guys out because this was boggling my brain for a while just to make sure I got all the little boxes checked in the right place to make sure we got the, the right output and the right format that we wanted in the right aspect ratio. So there we go, guys. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and uh, plenty more great content on the way. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel and there's a great lot of videos back there on Reaper and lots of other audio mixing stuff as well. And we'll catch you guys very soon. Cool. Cheers.